Hi everybody! Welcome! Uh huh, look, my fingernail chipped so I took that nail off and I forgot that I had to redo it. Oopsies! <laughs> Don't worry about me, it's all good. <laughs> Hi guys! Good morning! From a uh, not very sunny Australia, cold, chilly Australia today. Uh, my name's Belinda, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Welcome to new members, subscribers and patrons. Thanks for joining. Hi, Abby, Alex, Diane, Emily, Isolina, Janine, Pamela, Sarah, hello and happy birthday. Tori, hello and welcome. I Selena Shadow has knocked things over many times before, including a whole cup of water is why I brought my big uh, glass <laughs> containers because she just crawls up and around things and doesn't watch what she's doing. Hello, hi. <laughs> No problems. 5 p.m. Thursday. It's Friday morning here. Right and early. 10 a.m. <laughs> 10 a.m. And uh, yeah, we, we, we're we going to do something chillaxing today. Uh, Isabella is a beautiful person and uh, she did want to do something new for this colour along but with everything in the world today it's just too much so... <laughs> Um, I said to her, that's okay, relax. <laughs> I really like this image because it kind of reminds me of me. Uh, it's her Viva La Curves. I think it's Julie, Julene, maybe. Is that how you pronounce it? I'm not sure. Uh, but absolutely gorgeous. The link for the image is uh, in, it's pinned to the top of the live chat. It's also in the description under the video beside it, wherever you're watching it. Um, so go check it out. Also, too, there's a link, um, if you're reading down the description, it says, if you would like to get a colour list, click here, and it takes you to um, Patreon, and there is a colour list in JPEG and PDF format, so you can download it. There's different, uh, pencil conversions on there as well, so you can use... Uh, other brands. Also I post up my swatch chart so if you don't have any of the brands that I've you know uh, converted them to uh, perhaps you could try to match them similar using your own brands with the swatch chart. Hi Terralene welcome. Welcome. <laughs> so um, go check that out as well link in the description. I'm going to be using Strathmore Tanto and I'm going to use the thinner one. Uh, so this is the sketch paper, medium surface. Because I've only got two pieces of my thicker one left, so I figured, well, I've got a whole book of this, so we should use it up. <laughs> we should use it up. <laughs> Hi, Barbara, welcome. So I am going to use it up. Now, this paper is a little bit more temperamental uh, than white paper because it's got little uh let's have a look here it's got a little like uh what do they call them i don't know it's like part of the pulp of the paper um to create the color it, it's like little it almost looks like little hair like things but we're just gonna you know deal with them you know they're there so I'm glad there's none that are really prominent in the skin though because you know but I'm um, up here in the in the in the thing there we can cover that oh good uh this one's hang on let me just put this up isolate so you can see that pause it or nine by twelve eight pound 118 gsm this is a tantone sketch paper medium surface so the other one that i use is mixed media uh which i think is vellum surface yeah vellum surface and it's a lot thicker it's uh it's like i don't know 300 gsm or something like that very very thick so this one's fine 
this one is fine. I apologize for my voice. I've been a little bit uh, under the weather and um, still recovering from a bit of asthma. So if I sound puffed out and <laughs> taking lots of breath, <sighs> that's why. <laughs> so um, I'm wearing my hoodie because I'm cold. <laughs> It's cold. It's cold. Uh, now, what I've tried to do is make it as easy as possible, but sometimes it's not easy. It's hard to explain. It's hard to tell you what kind of pressure I'm using and things like that. So, uh, be uh, be nice to yourself and don't get frustrated if it's not going right. Have a practice. If you're new at it and you're not sure you want to give it a go, print four on a page four small ones and have a practice uh, don't feel like you have this pressure of doing this massive image straight up print four or two on a page and uh, just just practice it don't don't try to you know don't expect yourself to get it perfect the first time around it takes time and practice okay and this paper is temperamental as I said so it takes a little while to get used to it's 80 degrees. It's like five here. What well, feels like that? Let me look. I'll tell you what it is. <laughs> Apparently it's nine. Nine degrees Celsius. Feels like nine degrees Celsius. Oh, there you go. It's only going to be 13 today. Great. Great. I hate cold. Okay, I need glasses. I can't do anything without my glasses. Let me grab them. Somewhere. Here we go. Ah, uh, Terrilyn, no problems. No problems. You can always watch back. Video is always available. I'll also put them into playlists as well at the end. I have the hiccups. Why do I have the hiccups? I don't know. All right, now I am a little bit behind. Uh, I think I'm about 12 seconds behind today in uh, the chat. So if I haven't answered you, I hopefully will shortly. <laughs> and uh, okay, got my glasses. I'm ready, I'm ready to go. Yeah, I'm ready to go. <laughs> All right, especially if you're following along and you want to learn, you, you can come back and watch. I'm going to try to go about there. Let's actually. Oh, whoa. Come on, focus. Here you go. Looks pretty good. <laughs> oh, dear me. All right, so we're going to start with some ivory. Now, Cam was awesome and went and picked this up for me because I, uh, this is my ivory. It's tiny. So um, I'm going to use the little one, but I do have a, a fresh one. Why is that still not quite right? There we go. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Oh, 91, Barbara. Nice. Okay, so we're going to, so this is really thin paper, so I don't want to do too much pressure. Um, <clears throat> We're going to do like extremely light, like feather light. Feather, feather, feather light. <laughs> Cannot stress that enough. Really, 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 really light. Okay. And uh, we're just going to do a really light layer of ivory. Ebony and ivory. Ivory. And then we're going to do it all over the skin. We really are. Yep, all over. Just really lightly. And you know what? It just kind of gives us a bit of a base because this paper's a little bit thinner. 
bit more temperamental. I'm going to give myself something to work from. So we're going to base it up first. Hey, that's a new saying. Base it up. <laughs> How light? Feather light. Okay. <laughs> like you're playing with feathers. Uh, try holding your pencil on more of a, a horizontal angle rather than vertical. Rather than holding it like this, hold it more like this. And uh, try doing it on the side of the pencil. Just to give you a lighter touch. It's a lot harder to do firmer pressure on this kind of angle. You tend to break leads uh, really easily like this. So... Uh, just, you know, giving you an idea of how light you should be. I think it was uh, Tammy once challenged me and said, I bet I could go hard using my pencil like that. I'm like, I'm sorry, sure you could, but you're likely to break pencils. <laughs> Let's just... Uh... Really? Really? It is, Emily. I agree. It's very pretty. Shadow? Shadow? Don't start. She's uh, not enjoying the cold, actually. She's kind of struggling a bit with it. Can tell she's getting older. She's 13 in August. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> that sounds about right. Just coming in over all of the skin on the face. Don't forget the, the ear in here. We're going to go from light to dark in this, in this uh, image. A little bit different. Normally we do uh, dark to light, but I just think the paper, I don't know. I just wanted to find the easiest way to do it with the type of paper it is. So I had a play and this is what I found was easiest, quickest. You can see where I've covered over because it's really pale. Hi Della, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Oh, I'm using polychromos pencils too. I don't think I posted that. I should, I'll grab a link for that because um, they're one of my favourite, favourite pencils. Um, they last ages. And, uh, you know, the fact that, you know, Cam's gone to pick me up at her. What? Uh, I forgot the exclamation mark. You know, that helps. It does. It doesn't work without it. <laughs> Nightbot's very picky. He says, no, 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 you can't just write the word. You have to put an exclamation mark in front of it. There you go. Hi, Lulu. Welcome. <laughs> welcome. This artist is Ros. It's Ros Rice So Wanna Mama. 
or Isabella. <laughs> I should ask her where the name came from. Meow. Oi. I did post this up in a group, but uh, I don't know any of the admins, so uh, I don't know if they approved it. So, ah, Shadow. No. No. No, don't kiss me. You suck up. No, kissing does not work. She's gone, but I love you. I kiss you. Just kissing you, see? Crazy kitty. Uh, I keep going to colour in the hair. And uh, we don't want to colour in the hair. <laughs> it's Isabella. It's a Z. Z. Isabella. Did I say it wrong? Just wait, what? <laughs> wait, what? I didn't, did I? She's sitting right next to me, look. <coughs> Mama, kiss me. <laughs> Stop kissing me, it tickles. Mama, play with me. Oh, See, she did it. <laughs> I, Selena, is proof. She just knocked over my bucket of pencils again. <laughs> Let's do it back in again. Oh, crazy cat. You're a crazy cat. You really are. I just missed a little bit in there. Good. I know I've missed it because it's not pale. There we go. Oh, it looks like I might have missed a little bit up there too. She's like, come on. <laughs> Hi, Mona. Welcome. My daughter actually uh, made uh, the intro for me. I kind of told her what I wanted and she came back with it. And I was like, this is awesome. <laughs> She's uh, doing graphic no uh oh i don't know what it's called i think it is graphic design i don't know they're doing advertising and like web design and video making and ad making and things like that i don't know what it's called <laughs> possibly graphic design that's uni Oh, just lightly. Oh my gosh, my ear. It keeps popping. About four o'clock this morning, I woke up and sat up and I was like, what is that noise? And I realized it was my ear. I was like, oops. Now, we're going to do leave these little dribble marks. Um... It doesn't matter if you go over them, but we are going to come over those with white in a minute. Oh, 
working and lurking. Okay. Work and lurk away. Just going to come down into the water a little bit there just a little bit a little bit more now I put aside four weeks to do this one but it may take us five because there's a lot of detail in it um, but there's not a lot of detail at the same time so I don't know I, I thought this month has has a like I was going to have a break this week and then start next week but um I thought no let's do it because you know <laughs> It might need five weeks. <laughs> Actually, I don't have an artist set up for uh, August. Oh dear. I better get my butt into gear and find someone. <laughs> better get my butt into gear. So anything new happening? Anyone going away for the weekend? I know that uh, apparently... Wait, it, it, somebody said that it's... Is that this weekend, the 4th of July? You guys celebrate? I don't know why you celebrate it, so enlighten me. And you know, I'll probably say the same thing next year, so you'll have to enlighten me again next year. But you know, for now... <laughs> You're lurking, no worries. All I know is that uh, today is the first day of the financial year. So, uh, So 1st of July already here. Hi Kimmy, welcome. It's been ages. Independence Day on the 4th of July. Okay, and what does that mean? Don't you want against the aliens? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Sorry, maybe it's not funny. Oops. Oh, because we're not independent. We're still a commonwealth. We're still under the Queen of England. We have a queen? All right, Miss Julene, you are a stunner, and uh, we're going to do some more of you. Supposedly, we gained our independence from Britain.
Your sister's birthday was the 4th and you were always so jealous we would spend the day at the beach and see fireworks. Ah. You've always had a combo party too, Sarah. Nice. So I guess your Independence Day is kind of like our Australia Day, in a way. Kind of. It's not the same, but you know. All right. Now, before I move on to any other colors, I want to add uh, just a tiny bit of white in a couple of spots. So, but I'm going to use the white Prisma color pencil for this bit. Oh, I'm losing my voice again. Hang on, I need to cough. Hang on a sec. Okay, that's better. <laughs> All right, so I've got a white Prisma color pencil. The reason I'm going to use a white Prisma is because it's very opaque and it sits really nicely on top of the paper. And it's just going to allow me to have some nice highlights where I need them. So one of those highlights is going to be just still really gently, just across the top of the head here. Just going to add that in there. Kind of scratchy like. And let's just move that down across the top of the eye here. And I'm going to keep moving it down to the edge of her face here. Let's do some on her nosies. And uh, we will come in at the end and we'll do a line around the outside. But for now, let's do these little dribbles of, uh, of juicy. <laughs> dribbles of juice. That sounds just lovely. <laughs> juicy dribbles. Hi Sherry, welcome. I'm, oh, I don't know. <laughs> That's how I am. There's another one here. And here. And then obviously we have these little drips on our arm. Which I'm just going to colour over. I'm going to use a little bit of a firmer pressure to do these two so I should have said that a second ago but look at this water running down her arm Look at that. Drip, drip, drip. Alrighty. <laughs> Did I say hi, Christina? I'm kind of, my mind's a little bit gone at the moment. <laughs> I hope I did, my dear. Okay, now we're going to move on. What colour should we do next? I think we should do some rose carmine. This is a pretty colour. Rose carmine. Can you please move? Kitty? Kitty kitty. Can I paint your nails? Your claws? She's making out I'm not impressed face. She's like pulling back her chin towards her chest and puffing up like don't touch me. 
Rachel. You're a cranky kitty. You are, but you're in my way. Seriously. Well, actually, that's probably good. Now, <laughs> now, pool party sounds nice. Oh, Barbara, I mine's a little bit like that. My old one was. Uh, now he's a doesn't like anything. So <laughs> now, Rose Carmine, we're kind of going to do a bit of a line across her cheek. We're going to give her that like flushed kind of look. But she is in the bath after all, and I'm sure it's warm. So uh, I'm just going to use circular motions. And we're just going to fill in. This color across her cheek. So I'm coming across, coming across, watching the hair there. I mean, I would certainly have a red face from being in the shower, in the bath, or the shower, either. Come out with a red face. On top of the nausea. I want to add a little bit of this just to the shadowy parts as well. You're not going to be able to see a lot of it, but uh, we're just going to add it. There you go. And uh, we're going to come out the other side. So coming over this side. Adding a bit of a red to her cheekies. Look at that. Ah, look at that. Just like, oh, it's hot in here. <laughs> it's hot in here. Okay, I need a drink. <laughs> it's getting hot in here. Anyway, I'm not going to go any further with that one. <laughs> Um, let's do some beige red, which uh, previously was called uh, light flesh, <laughs> and uh, I actually have uh, one that's here that's not quite finished yet. So, and now uh, we're actually going to do repeat the same process all over. So let's do that. Lightly again. I'm going to come over the white a little bit too. I'm not worried about that. Just to make it lighter in that area. Sounds kind of scratchy because I'm just kind of glossing over the paper. I'm not putting any pressure down. Just adding a really light layer.
Boot camp sounds scary to me. I had a friend who wanted to go in the army when we were in year 12. I'm not sure if she ever did. I haven't really seen her since high school. So it's quite possible. Are you going, why are we doing so many layers? Is this you have a point? It does. It's just gradually building up colour, giving us some nice depth in shape. Stop looking at me like that. She will be in administration. That's good. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I always saw it as being scary. I, I, uh... It's like, oh my gosh, they do that to people? Although, I've been watching, watching some true crime uh, videos and uh, I was watching about the Elon school. It's like wow that's just scary I love um, Isabel's Viva La Curve images. They're so sweet and they're so me. <laughs> I'm like, I love them. Yep, this isn't the only one. There's a one with a uh, bubble girl. Uh, I think there's three of them? I don't know. I like the chunky girls. Oh, 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 also too, uh, Monday I was supposed to be doing the letter T, uh, but I did get asked by Kevin T.O. Art to to uh, a little bit of a uh, advertisement because there's a it's kind of like an advent calendar that he's doing and uh, you purchase it and you get 15 images over the month of over the two months of July and August and also, I know there's two extra images and also some surprises. So there's supposed to be some some extra stuff. So uh, it looks really cool. And uh, I said that I would advertise it. Uh, and if you purchase it, 
you know halfway through the month that's okay you just get all the images that everyone else has got already uh, and then you'll continue on the mailing list to uh, receive the rest of them over that period of time so it's very cool so uh, I thought uh, I would do that it is awesome it's going to be a mixture of the anime stuff and a mixture of the other things so it's not not anything specific um actually I thought we would have got the first one by now but it might come later today uh so yeah it's very very cool so I thought I'd color one of the bonus images and um and then we can can show you more info then but uh it's on the Kevin Teo art Etsy shop and uh it's it's a summer I think it's called like a summer advent calendar or something like that very cool very very cool so uh, I thought I'd do an advertisement for that on Monday instead we will get to the alphabet. I mean, we don't have to finish it anytime soon. I don't have a, a uh, expiry date on it, so we'll get to T. I mean, we've nearly finished it. It's just, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Hi, Selena. I actually just watched Wheels of Time again. There's a few things I missed the first time I watched it, so it was good watching it again. I just finished watching From with my friend. I watched another Stephen King series from like 2017, I believe. Uh, the Mist. Don't know why they didn't make any more of those. That was interesting. There's a new docu-series coming out, uh, I think it's called The Girl in the Photo, about a serial killer who abducted someone and at a young age and ended up marrying her when she was older. It's kind of one of those serial killer documentary things. I'm not sure I like this little area here, but I've got white. I, I didn't, uh, I just want to add a little bit of white to this collarbone area here and uh, I'm just going to cover it back over with the with the uh, beige red all right we're all covered with 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 beige red no, it, she was a child, like four. Um, so she thought, 
he was her father. <laughs> so, yeah, it wasn't Stockholm. It was freaky. <laughs> um, she wasn't in love with him or anything like that either. It comes out today, actually, on Netflix. So, um, apparently, probably tonight, knowing Netflix... about seven all right now what's next uh might just add some cinnamon next cinnamon you have to find a rose can't think of the whole name but it's stephen king okay uh i never ended up watching the next season of the stand either because i couldn't bear it <laughs> it's like what <laughs> <laughs> Carrie <Ugh. laughs> well from has been interesting so far I've got cinnamon and uh, this time we're going to concentrate on certain areas uh, so I'm going to concentrate on the shadowy areas so first of all looking at the side of her face here I'm going to add a little bit of a shadow here so still using light pressure uh, what's happening now is though it's getting easier and easier for me to add layers on because the previous layers have smoothed the paper out a little bit and it kind of allows the pencil to glide along a little bit so we're going to just do this little section here that and I think we should sort of bring this down a little bit are you good she's poking me are you poking me what's the matter <laughs> she's like pat me pat me hi <laughs> Jennifer welcome It's funny, uh, it's so cold here and you guys are talking about trying to get cool. Come to Australia, Victoria, uh, or Tasmania, where it's cold. <laughs> Closest to the Antarctic here, so, you know, let's come join B in the cold. <laughs> All right, just coming down on the side of the face. I just did a little bit in the ear. Just joining into the pink there. Coming down here, you can see there's a bit of a grey already marked here. So I'm going to go over that, bring it out there. I think it might actually uh, bring this all the way around the bottom here. So I'm going to stop there for a minute. I'm going to come to this side. This side is going to be a lot darker. So I'm going to cover that whole section there. Quite a bit of a shadow under her hair there. Bring that all the way out. Coming all the way into the eye, it's going to be nice and dark in here. And 
and then the heel. You need air conditioning. <laughs> mm. I have air conditioning. We get warm here in Australia too. We get extreme. We get like cold and hot. <laughs> We don't get too cold. We don't snow here, so it's 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 still probably normal for <laughs> you guys, maybe. <laughs> maybe not where you are, Abby. I know that uh, it gets quite warm there. I don't know if it gets raining or not, but I mean, cold. Now I've just gone over all of those dark grey areas and added a little bit of a layer. So there was a bit of a cheek line here. Just gone and added that in. Just gone over it a couple of times and nose. And there's these like little like cheek dimples. Let's add them in a little bit firmer. And then I'm going to colour over all of this section. So just coming in, using the side of my pencil again. Putting underneath the mouth. Making sure I cover under the nose and on the top of the lip. Put a little bit on the pink there as well. I'm going to cover the rest of that side of the face as well. Now I haven't done this eye so I'm just going to come in here do the eye. Underneath the eye there's a little bit of a ditch so I'm just going to go over that few times. There's also another one here which is kind of hiding, hiding by the hair but I'm just going to add a little bit on there. A bit around the hair here. I think we're good. We're just going to get darker and darker and darker. But wait, I'll be right back.
Okay, sorry about that. Be right back, your highness wants to go. <laughs> <coughs> She is taking a bath. She's sitting in the bath, relaxing. Is that what you mean? <laughs> she is. She's relaxing. We're going to move down to her neck. In fact, the giveaway this week, we're going to, I think I might use that word. So uh, this week, uh, Isabella is giving away your choice of image from the Ros Riso Wanna Mama Etsy shop. <laughs> And uh, if you enter, you will need, and you win, you will need to give me your email address so I can pass that on to her and uh, she can email you your price. Yeah, let's do that. Shall we do a giveaway? Kind of screen there. I'm kind of sitting way back in my chair. Thank you, Janine. Hi, Rinka. Welcome, Marilyn. Hello. Welcome. Oh no, twelve hours. Oh no. Hi, Robin. Welcome. Thank you for joining. Hi, Loretta. Welcome. I missed you before. All right, so yay, giveaway. <laughs> yeah, if you would like to enter that giveaway, you will need to enter the word relax, R E L A X, relax, uh, to enter. I like tan toad. It uh, it makes things nice, <laughs> and I don't use it enough. So I should say that I want to use it more. I'm still using cinnamon and we're starting now to create some really nice shadows. Hi Catherine, welcome. I'm going to just gently come into, there's like shadowy parts in the water. So I'm just going to come in and add this into those shadowy sections. Give a shadow here, right along the bottom, 
I'm going to come up a little bit. We're going to be mixing skin colour with the watercolour a little bit so that uh, we can sort of see her skin through the water slightly. All right, so how'd everyone go? Did you enter it? We had 14 people enter. Anyone else want to enter quickly before we finish it off? Write the word relax. <laughs> relax. Well done, Diane just jumped in there. Anyone else? All right, it is random. Nightbot will draw a winner. does adding white on tan tone paper helps i think just give you those little highlights it does all right i'm gonna draw it let's uh relax <laughs> the red has just got in there to relax <laughs> Relax is what I need, is why I'm doing it. <laughs> Zoom out a little bit so you can see it so far. So far, so good. All right, I'm going to draw it because, you know, everyone's entered. And a rolling the giveaway. Should I go? <laughs> Robin, congratulations. You get to pick your choice of image from the lovely Isabella's Etsy shop, Ros Rice. So, one of my mind, no, never know if I'm saying it right. Alrighty. Let's add a little bit of a shadow underneath our little water droplets. We're going to get a little bit firmer in there later. Adding in some shadows. I think I got all of the darker parts. It's kind of, I don't know about the shape of the hand here. <laughs> I'm always funny with hands. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. I always hated my hands. I, and I never in a million years thought that I could do something like this. I didn't even have a photo taken of my hands uh, with the ring on at the wedding, you know, like, <laughs> just like a... <laughs> I don't know. I always felt like I had old lady hands, even when I was younger. <laughs> old lady hands.
now I'm older, it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm an older lady now, so I can have old lady hands. My hands hardly change, have changed. Like, they've always been old lady hands. <laughs> yeah, it's funny, isn't it? It is funny. It's funny for me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Diane. Sorry. <laughs> A rubbing. You need to email me your type of image. Just thought I'd better write that down. And congratulations. Okay. Let's do. I'm right, just going to do a little bit more here. I'm liking it. We got another quite a few layers, so I'm just gonna keep moving. Moving on, moving on. Where is my kaput mortem violet? Kaput mortem mortuem violet. Kaput. <laughs> kaput. Probably could do with a pencil extender on this one. Uh, I've run out, so too bad, so sad. <laughs> I'm going to come over all of the shadowy areas now. I'm going to put a bit of pressure in the very dark spots. First. In the nose, nostril holes. Just around the crease of the nose. Quite a shadow there. I think I might add a bit of a shadow in here as well. I think that's part of the eye kind of socket there. Coming above there. All right. Let's add a little bit darker in these little cheeky little dimples. Alright, now we're going to add a bit of a shading. So using my pencil on the side here, I'm just going to go into the shadowy areas and just lay this down. Okay, I'm going to move down here. And I'm going to add a bit down here. Now she's got these like shadows where her hair is laying over her face. I'm going to colour those in. Oh. 
That scratching it in shadow. Come up over the top of the head just lightly here. And I'm going to come on the side of the face. I don't want too much here because this is the where the light's kind of shining on her. But we're going to add a little bit of depth. So I'm just going to add about that much shadow. You're covering my light. Again. <laughs> Anniversary 27th. Ooh, that's freaky. Long time. No. Well, you're on my. You're sitting flat out. You're sitting on my work. Why? Why must you do it? Why? <laughs> she says, I don't know. I just want to do it. I cannot move it over anymore. They won't be able to see. What are you doing? Why? And you always put your face off camera. Everyone wants to see you and all you want to do is just look away. What's this? Oh, hello. Let's give you a cuddle and then you can go, okay? Cuddle, cuddle. Yes, cuddle, cuddle. Miss Attitude Cat. <laughs> she is demanding attention. She's attacking my hand right now. She's like, kiss, kiss, kiss. I want to kiss you. I went to kiss you. <laughs> oh, yeah, she, she is. Look at those eyes. Oh, she just attacked me. Look at this. She's attacking me now. Ow. That's so mean. <laughs> Look, you beat me. I was just patting you. It's so mean to me. <laughs> it can be mean back. She is a monster. She is a monster. She's like so sassy and attitude like. <clears throat> oh, now look, my arms are red. Oh, 35. You're a baby. You're a baby. I just turned 44. It's scary. I never thought I'd make it to that age. <laughs> I did not think that I would make it. Oh, that's normal. I have to put up with that every day. She's just a psycho kitty. Uh, 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 uh. It's not a psycho killer. It's a psycho kitty. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> run, 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 run away. <laughs> Fluffy butts off the page. I agree, Diane. I agree. Get off the page. <laughs> and yes, she's very naughty. 
there. Let's add a little bit of a shadow under there. I'm just coming under the hair. I'm just getting rid of shadows here. It's all good. It's all good. A little bit on the nosies. And we're just gradually building up. Whoa, hello. Uh oh. She's just banging on the door. Someone's supposed to be looking after her. Doesn't sound like they're doing their job, does it? <laughs> sound like it does it <laughs> she's, she's just you know hello i'm here why is nobody paying me attention she must have stuck out of wherever she was I can't believe it's already 11.30, like it's already been an hour and a half and I feel like we've done nothing. We've done nothing. So uh, next week's colour list is not really going to change <laughs> because we haven't finished. Well, good. We've still got half an hour. We might be able to get a little bit more of the face, face, the face defined. In fact, let's do that. Let's, I know I don't like to do it, but I'm going to. Let's do this later. And let's work on the face. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to repeat the same process, but we're going to go backwards. So uh, I'm going to go to a cinnamon again. A cinnamon, 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 cinnamon. Oh my gosh, you made me bleed. Look, there, that was tooth. And there, it's like she grabbed it like that. <laughs> like there, and there, little tooth marks. Meanie. <laughs> what a meanie. Okay, sharpen that a little bit. Oh, Loretta, birthday. So, cinnamon. And I'm going to come over the darkest parts and extend further out so we're just starting to smudge it out a little bit now make it look a little bit smoother Just blending the edges off. It's 
came all the way out over the skin here. There's also going to be a little bit of adjusting. So yours might look great in some sections and you might need to adjust it in others. We're just going to play around with it until we get the look that we're looking for. And she's already starting to look amazing. We're just going to bring this up and around, coming out towards the edge of the light. Oh, I call shadow uh, an each. <laughs> because she is. <laughs> She's full on. She's full on. She's not nice. Never. She's never been nice. I am annoyed because there's a bit of paper there that's not colouring. That is annoying. Just coming over the darker colour and then just coming out now over all of the areas that are covered with the cinnamon before. So we're putting a little bit of pressure, not too much, just on those darkest areas and then we're just releasing that pressure to come out over the areas that we went over earlier. Just so we don't make her look like she's got a beard or you know, we're trying to make that skin look kind of smooth. So technically this is a second low layer over the side of the face here of this color. So we've got some nice pigment on our paper.
Back onto the nose. Looking good. All right, next we're going to red beige or light flesh, depending on what you've got. Oh, Pamela, see you later. Hi, Tammy, welcome. <laughs> I'm just uh, off in another world today. I am off in another world. All right, so we've got the what color? Like <laughs> uh, beige, red, or light flesh, depending on what you've got. We're going to go over everything like we did the first time. We've skipped white. You may have noticed. I don't need to do white again and we're actually going to try to smooth out those dark areas if we can get rid of any lines that might be there just smoothing it off Nice. Do that side. How nice and smooth that's looking. We're kind of uh, eradicating the pink a little bit, so we're definitely going to need to come back in and do more pink to give her those nice pink, pink uh, flushed looking cheeks.
Now we want to add back in our pink. And I think we need to uh, give her a little bit more of her yellow back. <laughs> We've taken it away. Evening. It's morning. You're off in another world most days. Ah, uh, yes. Well, you know. We live in Australia. We're allowed to. <laughs> so I've got rose, um, rose carmine. To think about what it was then. And we're going to redo our pink cheeks, our flushed bit, making her neck warm and, uh, I don't know, kind of cozy, I guess. Giving her that look like, ah, uh, this is good. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> you know what I mean. You shush. Shadow's like, no, I don't. You're just being mean. Coming around the nose. Let's flatten it off. Oh, it's already the weekend. We usually have that happen too over the before New Year's, uh, over the few weeks, over Christmas and that. They usually set a few off. I'm going back to Ivory now. And uh, I'm just going to go back over everything. I'm going to go over the pink again just to smooth it out. Get nice and soft looking. Just blending out from the light towards the dark. I don't want to go over the dark too much. Um, I don't want to flatten it off too much, get rid of it. We want to keep it if we can. Keep the shadows if we can. Smooshing the pink out.
looking good. I think we could go pinker. Pinker? Pinker. Does that wax go over poly well? What wax? What wax are you talking about? I don't understand. <laughs> I've got Rose Carmine again. Tell me what you mean. Let's go darker. Thor in the bath, what? <laughs> Thor in the bath. <laughs> Like Chris Hemsworth Thor or Natalie Portman Thor. Sure why, but I can't seem to smooth it off there. It doesn't want to let me smooth it off. Okay, we want to keep this nice pink cheek. We do. We want to keep it. <laughs> She's starting to look cool. <laughs> Sherry, I'm not sure of your question. Could you re-ask it, please? <laughs> re-ask it, please. All right, we need to add some more kaput mortem. Um, she's lost a little bit of a... Uh, it's hard to see under the light, but she uh, needs a little bit more kaput. Some touch ups. Oh, you saw Elvis. Did you like it? Did you like it? Was it good? Is it worth seeing? I really wanted to see it. I saw the clip and went, oh, I so want to see that. But I, I don't know. What do you think? It, 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 did the clip show all the good parts? <laughs>
Just adding some shadows. And as I said, this is where we're going to just touch up things. You might not feel like you need to in some areas or you might need to in other areas. So you just kind of go where you think you need to go. And I kind of feel like I need to add a little bit more cinnamon. And then I think I might be right. Uh, so let's do that. Some cinnamon. cinnamon. And then ding the edges off. Keeping it nice and smooth. Just making sure I come into the pink a little bit there just to make it all nice and even. And I feel like we need to just add more cinnamon into the edge of the face here. It's looking good. Ah, oh, I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it a lot.
Alright, I'm going to use a little bit of uh, the beige red. Just soften up those shadows a tiny bit there under the hair. Neaten up anything I need to neaten up. I don't want to use white because I don't want to soften it too much. But there was a couple of areas that needed just smoothing off. Alright, I'm going to turn that light off so you can see her a little bit better. I think the uh, light is reflecting off her a little bit too much there. But um, she's looking really pretty. Looking pretty. Bit of cinnamon again. Gotta remember, uh, yeah, when I'm under the camera, the light is reflecting and it just sort of makes it look a little bit lighter than it actually is. So if yours is looking kind of dark and you're like, why is yours not looking dark? Well, this is why. Because <laughs> we had this wonderful light here. It makes it easier to see, but uh, it also makes it look like it's darker, lighter than it is. Uh-huh. And that in a little bit. So I've just touched up with the cinnamon and the beige red. If you can kind of see that a little bit. <laughs> it looks good. It's looking good. We've got 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Yes, red beige is actually also named uh, beige red, sorry was originally light flesh so number 132 and it is a little bit more pink all right let's just add a couple of details in the last 10 minutes which will give it and it'll give it at least it's starting to look look finished <laughs> um I'm going to do some walnut brown and I'm going to do this on the eyebrows. No, you are not going to attack me again with your little claws. Go on, off you go. Yeah, you'll get squirted. No, she says. Little flicks with a sharp pencil to make these fluffy looking eyebrows other side
Noise. Noise. What about uh, some black? Some black. I mean, I don't believe she would have makeup on in the mask, but maybe she couldn't be bothered and thought, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna actually leave these bits of cucumber on my eyes. I'm gonna eat them, so I don't, I don't think I'll bother taking off my makeup. <laughs> I don't know. doesn't matter as long as she's happy and relaxed, right? Wow. <laughs> right? Right. <laughs> as long as she's happy and relaxed. 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 <laughs> Adding a little bit more cinnamon to that. Hi. Good morning. Good afternoon. Oh, so it's still morning. Five it's minutes. Just yes, we just. Oh, yeah. She bit me. She bit you on camera. They 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 can bear witness to it. Oh, shadow shadow <laughs> doesn't bite. <laughs> yeah, she does. She's horrible. What's the matter? Did mummy ignore you? Hey, got you a cup of tea. Thanks. As an apology from, from Shadow. <laughs> right. I'm doing a little no? bit more pink. A bit more pink? You're blushing, is she? Yeah. Oh. No, she's not blushing. She's in a hot bath. Oh. Okay. So she's hot. Feeling hot, hot, hot. It's getting hot in here. <laughs> Technically, she took off all her clothes because she's in the bath. Am I meant to be making some comments here, or...? No, I don't know. Is there a comment that you'd like to make Yeah. <laughs> Nothing that I can say. Should I not ask that? No, not unless you're going to mute it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to smudge that out a little bit with the... Uh, the beige red light flesh. She really is being mean. Just be careful. Oh, <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Let's do some of the eye. <laughs> yeah, that's my fault. Uh, we're going to add a little bit of dark indigo. Dark indigo. Really lightly. Just on the shadow section. Do you want to zoom in a bit? Because I did zoom out. You're noisy. Shh. Shadow. Noisy. Then I've got a little bit of the beige red or light flesh. Corner there. And just over the top of the dark indigo, just sort of blending it out a little bit. Oh wow, I'm rattling speakers. Hey. <laughs> Helen, thank you so much for joining and uh, have a great weekend. I hope you enjoy yourself.
we're going to use uh, some white but this time we're going to use the polychromos white thanks Abby and we're just going to blend this out like that I'm going to put a little bit of a highlight in her eye here with the white nice put a little bit bye more. Helen bye Abby who knows Abby you're going to oh Abby bye 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 now bye 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 I'm just gonna add a tiny bit more black there how could it be unexpected? I uh, I couldn't sneak in. Shadow wouldn't let me. <laughs> she wouldn't, would she? Nope. <laughs> she would not let him. No. Yes. All right. Uh, oh, and uh, let's finish the eyes off, shall we? Dark indigo again. And I'm just going to put that on these. Really? Oh, Abby's not leaving. She thought you were. No, I'm not finished yet. I'm nearly done. Nearly. I figured we should get the eye done at least. And then next week we'll do some more skin and uh, her lips and her nails. And the cucumber. And... and that can be the following week. Okay. We finish all of the skin first, and we still got hair to do before what we. What color you doing the towel? The head wrap. Blue. Blue. Yeah, blue. <laughs> I've got cobalt, a blue green. Ooh, nice. For the eyes. quite strange but there's a lot going on in this picture there is and then I've got a little bit of white just to come over that just smooshing it in a little bit smoosh smooshing bit of black for the middle of the people hey first time in a long time we've actually got a house full we've got a full house going on where yeah here at home yeah have we yep yeah everyone's here i'm i'm streaming so i don't know um. <laughs> you mean our family yes the whole family's here Not a bit the, more all, blue. All, all the all the all the offspring, all the children, all the kids. All the offspring. Well, they're not kids anymore, they're adults, so. Alright, and then uh, I think we're done for now. <laughs> she kind of looks a little off because of the light, but. What is, what is this? Cat, oh, my nail missing. Oh. Yeah, I know. I haven't had a chance to do it. Do you think, like, now that I've just turned that light off, I can see where it needs a tiny little bit more cinnamon just to darken it up a tad? True, they're always the kids. The offspring. <laughs> the offspring. Uh, good band, that. I think that's a little better. We just had... Pinky flush from the hot bar. Yeah, yeah. I like it. All right, we're going to use a little bit of white to uh, just white uh, Prismacolor because it's more opaque. 
I'll zoom in a little. Can't see what you're doing. I'm just coming around the edges oh, of the face. Actually, you can see that. Look at it. it. Yeah, that's what I hoped it would do. Oh, wow. <laughs> just give it a bit of a highlight. Nice. And because it's further away, you can see it as a whole. No other face. Okay. Let's add a tiny bit on the edge of the nose. I might zoom in for that. Tiny little bit just in here. And around the nostril. And I think we'll do them maybe before, because I don't want to have to come back to it, I guess. A little bit of white gel pen. Just going to add a couple little spots of white just around her eyelashes and just in the corner of her eye and on the bottom of the lid there. Come over those. A little bit of a shine in her eyes. Okay, zoom back out. <laughs> she looks awesome so far we're going to finish off her mouth and her teeth next week and then we'll do her hair and the rest of the skin as well and um, I will see you all on Monday we'll do some Kevin Teo art so go check out his uh, web uh, Etsy shop uh, for Monday and uh, see if you can see what I was just talking about with this the advent summer advent calendar and I'll go through it on Monday and we'll colour one of the special images, which you might not have yet. <laughs> it might be coming. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, a huge thank you to Isabella for this beautiful image. Congratulations to Robin for winning the giveaway. Make sure that you email me your choice of image. Thank you, everyone, for coming. A huge thank you to my subscribers, channel members, and patrons. And I will see you later. Have a great weekend. Happy 4th of July to the Americans here. I hope you have a great weekend. Also to the Aussies, have a good weekend too. <laughs> no worries, guys. If you have any questions, make sure you ask. Uh, also pop into the Facebook group. There's a chat there for the event as well. If you have any questions, uh, I will take a scan of this and uh, pop it up in the group as well so you can see it. All right, I'm done. You, you done? done? I'm done. You done. All right, we're done. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. See you Have next fun. time. See ya.